so but but like my most memorable moment was um so 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 it was time for prayers eh? <laughs> at, at the prayer meeting yeah so so, so 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 we start we start praying yeah <laughs> and then i'm just hearing a guy a guy next to me so someone is praying and, and i'm hearing a guy next to me say yes <laughs> Mm. Yes Lord, yes Lord, yes, yes Lord. Lord. <laughs> <laughs> Just so <laughs> sacrilegious. religious. So so so, so, so me I'm praying and I'm like, "Hey, but this this uh, I've, I mean me I grew up in Bapo. Like uh, you know, we don't shout in prayers, we don't do any of that stuff." So so I fungoed my eyes, eh? I'm like, "Hey, I'm like I think that's Kaima, like this guy Bana is he is <laughs> <laughs> it's quite it's quite spiritual." <laughs> But then I open my eyes and I see the guy the guy is like this. Yes lord. Yeah. <laughs> yes lord. Hmm. Yeah. Mm. Yes, yes, yes lord. Mm. So sacrilegious. <laughs> I still remember that. So at that story. point I was like, who's this? like what's wrong with this guy? And your aunt was praying, Mrs. Karanja. <laughs> she was on was praying. And then this guy is just looking around and just like lot totally sacrilegious. So I was like what's wrong with this? Like what what, what why would he do that? Like like, like why? <laughs> Uh, and, and and at that point I was like okay I think we're going to be pals but now cuz 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 this this chap is, is a whole other irreverent, a whole other level irreverent yeah so so and then what happened so I think that started hanging out and there was many things that happened in between these guys would come and hang out would go to the prayer breakfast I would be part of the youth leadership so we kind of building a youth group and then it was through that that we you know they just started singing and leading worship no we started playing basketball basketball hanging out hanging out hanging out playing basketball nini and then of course on sat on it was only one saturday a month the yeah. prayer breakfast by mr methu yeah who passed on but he's the guy who brought the Kenyan community together in los angeles mm-hmm. it was a much needed thing because when you're in diaspora you know you want a place where you can connect and that's how this we we came together because of this prayer breakfast so we mm. pay homage to Isaac Methu and those guys who just did an incredible job of bringing the Kenyan community together but then these guys would do worship and in fact i don't even know how they even invited me into it because i was like i don't see oh, you no know, you're the transport correct and money. oh that's why that's and, money. That's and why. money yeah and, and lunch Carl's junior every saturday when we started meeting for practices on saturdays at yeah. uh, at what what's what, what, uh, at marty's yeah. yeah so that's that's so just started hanging out ni 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 and then i think i still remember i think one of the one of our major the thing that just made us lock in uh-huh. is when Limitex came to the prayer breakfast. Bado, you you have gone so far. Ahead. Really? Yeah. Even before. You have what gone is far that? Ahead. What, what because happened? Because what happened yeah. even way before Limitex, yeah. we uh, we were like apart from playing basketball, is there something else we can oh. we can start engaging in? And then we were like the commonality between all of us was music. Was music yeah. Mm-hmm. Um so we so we actually I don't exactly remember how I can't even, what yeah. what our purpose was. We, I don't even think we had a purpose. I think we were just this is another way of hanging out. Yeah. So we'd meet um, at his yeah. workplace, which was uh, a really cool yeah, at that cultural, time, cultural center. Yeah, cultural center. Yeah. You know that had a piano and stuff, yeah. and we'd go and 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 just jam, jam, mm. really. Yeah. Let's learn this song. Let's learn yeah. that song. Whatever. And there was actually no purpose to it. Eh? We thought that you were. We're, we're not pre- trying to prepping for a gig or no. anything. Uh, oh yeah, until Marty said she had us playing and she said, "Hey, I'm doing the Y2K yes. night. It was year 2000 and yeah. she was doing a ka a ka big bash and she said, "You guys need to perform." Exactly. Like Allah? exactly. And that uh, was our first gig. That's our first gig. Yeah. That's so true. She's yeah. like, "Okay, you guys need to do this thing." And then she bought us zoot suits and then she bought us Will Brother. <laughs> yeah. Remember? Our... No, don't, don't you go to Will Brother. No. No, no. It was Marty. It was Marty, yeah. 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 Remember Will Brother? Will Brother, Will Brother died. Will oh, Brother died. died. Disintegrated. Yeah. <laughs> Will Brother, you guys Will. named your keyboard. Yeah. yeah. Will Brother died, and then there was Trufena. Trufena. Yeah. Tru, you you still have Trufena. Trufena is who you have. Yeah. Trufena, no, the tru, Trufena is a big one. Yeah. Yes, the yeah. big, the big, yeah. the, the the Yamaha. Yeah. I have Will Brother. I have Will Brother in the house. Yeah. Where's Will Brother? It's in the house. What do you mean? Oh, How? 
So you have oh, both of them. Both of them. Beste, you stole it. Beste, you never told us. Yeah, you never. We thought that thing went got lost. You, you stole, stole it. In my house. You're confessing now. <laughs> you have a confession, guys. You have a confession right now. You've just had yeah. it. <laughs> a guy stole our keyboard. Us guys, we thought that thing. You told us it died. <laughs> no, but it died. But it can still be you. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, 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 wow. Yeah, guys are harsh. <laughs> so, let, let me ask you, at this Y2K gig, do you perform any original? Or at this time, you're not even thinking in that sense? Mm-hmm. There were a couple songs. of originals. Did, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, some that he wrote, actually. Uh, yeah, yeah. and, and you guys start yeah. from, my, yeah. from my concert. Exactly. Yes. Yes. We did Sanjo yes. Lama. Yes. 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 We did a love so right as well. Love that, so was, right. that was from my... That was now and then Ali from my music before I met Milele. So, Sanjo Lama, what I'm hearing... Yeah. Which is one of Milele's biggest jams. Yeah, that's mine. <laughs> it's, all, it's all mine. I, I loaned it to Milele. <laughs> well, and you are given by Bomi Walu. Actually, it's all mine. Bomi Bomi Walu Mona was an incredible musician from the what's the eighties? Eh? Yeah. Uh, he was in a in a very famous band called Le Mangelepa. Hey, Le Mangelepa. And, and then he became a believer and started working at Life Ministries and there was a, there was a studio at Life Ministries and I s- became friends with him through Steve Oero, but that's a story for another day. And, and, and one day I asked him to give me a song and the song he gave me was Sanjo Lama. Sanjo Lama, Yahweh Nangai. Don't say, don't say. Come to the recording of Sanjo Lama now as Milele. So now you guys do this gig. Now at this time, do you, does it click and say, let's become a group? It actually kind of, because the, we looked really good. We, we had zoot suits. Well, according to my dad, oh, according to my dad, we didn't. <laughs> no, the, the, yeah, it was like, you didn't like the suit. Yeah? No, it was like, what, what are these hey, guys doing? I can I find pictures of those guys. No, 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 until, until you saw the Wazoom was clapping. He was like, this guy's actually <laughs> We, yeah, we showed up and it looked so nice. And we had, a, we had an outfit change because we tore the white suit and we had the green, um, um, green African shirts that your mom had given us. Oh no! So we had a wardrobe change yes. in the middle of the concert. Oh, your memory just nuts. Yeah, and then yeah, you remember that. And then and then at the end of the concert, yeah, Pastor M. Was Who there? Was not called M. Yeah, at that time he was uh, Pastor Andrew. Yes. <laughs> he'll he'll kill me for saying yeah. Andrew Anjao. Yes. But yes. Andrew Anjao yes. was yeah of, of Mavuno yeah. happened to be at the concert because we invited all our friends that we had and Pastor Mridi at that time was a student at Fuller, mm. so he came in and after the concert we were going to him for validation. And Pastor, we asked him, so how was it? And the guy looks at us and he says, man, you, you guys, guys look have nice suits. You guys have nice suits. <laughs> <laughs> didn't say anything about the music. Yeah. Didn't say anything about the concert. He just said, man, your suits were off the chain, <laughs> you know? But that's when it really was like, that was our first gig together, yeah. you know? Okay. You know? 
So it's now when this okay now let's talk about this limit X moment because Peter Dera also talked about it in a yeah, sense. Yeah. Just I want to hear it now your version of it. Is if that's where we go next. Yeah. Okay. 